Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. In April 2021, the Ministry of Defense had issued an official RFI for the phased purchase of 350 next generation light tanks under Make in India scheme of DAP 2020. The army wanted a light tank with combat weight not to exceed 25 tons and feature modular and upgradable main gun, secondary armament for anti-air and ground roles with a different caliber and remote assisted weapon station. The army has officially named the light weight tank program as Project Zoravar. Now the MOD has also given in principle approval for the development of light tank and the defense equation council is expected to accord the acceptance of necessity for the light tank soon. DIDO is a lead development agency for the light tank in partnership with LNT as development come production partner. We have been discussing about the India's upcoming lightweight tank Zoravar but what was not clear was its design. More information regarding the light tank is about to come out as the defense expo is nearby. If you have seen our earlier video, we have explained two possible designs for the lightweight tank. The first one was based on the K9 Vajra chassis and the second one was based on DRDO's next generation main battle tank or NG MBT design. Now recently JD Patel the member of executive committee of management and advisory to CEO and MD of LNT spoke to business line regarding the lightweight tank he said the development is on at full speed this is completely ab initio and not taking vajra design except for the engine and transmission everything can be done here since the equipment was done here not as tot that is transfer of technology a lot of equipment running gear suspension was built to specs the design is joint effort drdo and lnt and we are confident that the light tank will roll out on the test tracks by the middle of next year the two things which becomes clear from the statement of jd patel is that the design will be indigenous and not based on the keen and vajra and tanks development will be completed by the mid of 2023 next is engine and transmission the recently appointed chairman of drdo s kamath has also informed that light tank will be fitted with high altitude operable power pack of 1000 horsepower and capable of firing multiple ammunitions The tank is expected to have weight of 35 ton powered by MTU MT883 KA500 or 501 diesel engine delivering over 1100 kilowatt shaft power with 10 speed 5 forward and 5 reverse. The same engine is used in many western tanks such as Leclerc Challenger 2E and Mirakawa MK4. The gun to be featured in the light tank will be a 105 mm gun. with 7.62 mm coax machine gun along with armor protection of NATO Stenac 4569 level 4 the 105 mm gun to be featured is expected to be made by belgian firm john cockrell defense sa which can fire at a 42 degree elevation and suited for mountain warfare one more important point which is worth discussing is that if drdo proves the design for the lightweight tank it will also pave the way for development of next generation main battle tank to meet indian army's requirement of 1770 ng mbt under future ready combat vehicles frcv program the frcv is expected to follow the spv that is special purpose vehicles model similar to imrh and mk program The tanks are expected to be medium weight category and will remain in service for next 50 years. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.